after that roll of my PT Cruiser. I like gasoline! Oh, is that your couch? <laughs> Nothing can go wrong with this. Well, we are out here at Glen Helen Raceway for uh, race number four of the year. This is uh, my second PT Cruiser race, and we got another full set. I think we got nine, 10 cars out here. I shipped out five from last week, salvaged five of them. I actually could have salvaged more, but I didn't want to fix the clutches. Slave cylinders went out in them and didn't feel like dealing with it. So I think we got four or five more, and I haven't even looked at the track. Have you even looked, come over, have you even looked at the track? No. We haven't even looked at the track. I saw it online. It looked like there's a lot easier rollers. Like we could just bomb the whole thing. Do you want to win? With this one. You want to win? You like winning? Do you want to win? <laughs> hey, first, your ass, man. It was just a back row. We've been running. They're so excited. They, they're so excited. They figured out that batteries need a ground. All right, homie. So you're fresh up from the desert. You were just racing. So if you guys saw last the last video, this mother sent it every time. So he's geared up. We got the hero car for him today. Have you even looked at the track? No, no. It's some laughs, some rides, some jumps. <laughs> yeah, we'll, just yeah. full throttle. We'll figure it out. So are we all in on taking Jim out? Yes. So if he's yes. in front. Jim cannot. He's getting first. pit vipered. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna run a conservative lap. Yeah. At least figure out where I'm at. I say we roll, but we can't get him. We can't let him get away. And then send it. Okay. All right. All right. Let's roll. I was pissed I saw, but at least it started again. I was all by myself, hero and all by myself. <laughs> that jump was big though, bigger than I thought it was gonna be. I was like, oh, I was it, trying to send it the whole time, but I didn't know I could go out wide. I didn't know where the track was. They didn't show us anything, we just went. Yeah, I figured to go for the big jump. They're like, jump. just go right at there. That was like literally the only instruction they had. I was like, and then what? They're like, you'll figure it out. And I'm like, oh, right, I don't know where I'm going. The car literally died on that last jump. It stalled. It, I rolled all the way to the next jump. It was barely on. It was weird. Not running on every cylinder or something. Did you finish? Did you finish? I won. Oh, how nice. Yeah. Dude, I stalled out right away. Oh, shit. Sure. But then I started up again. So I had my own fun in the back. I got, I got 
track all to myself. I'm going over the finish line jump, and Nino's spare tire flies out of the back of his car at me. <laughs> Oops. Oh, yeah, that's spare tire. It's front, front too. So. <laughs> and the new girl, man, we forgot to get her airbag out. <laughs> How was it? It was good until my airbag that went off. That's not good. Good thing she was wearing a helmet. I had like a battery in my car. What's your bag? Really being super safe. And she had a full battery in the passenger seat. That's her own problem. <laughs> you got to check your ride. What up? What, what up? What happened? <laughs> I stalled out right out the gate. After I jumped, it stalled. If but I, 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 I brought up the rear. I finished. I made two laps this time. Fire yeah. Up my, yeah. What are we doing with these beauties now? They're done, man. Um, what are you doing with them? They're donated. My car still runs perfect. Take it. It's yours. I a trailer. I take it home. It's yours. <laughs> Mine's toasted. What? Watch your feet. <laughs> nice. That race was pretty bonkers, but all these stalls, I'm hoping a couple of them run. And uh, I got a, a couple experiments, you know, I know you guys have always wondered this, like you got to run nice, good, clean air filters and you can't, you know, you can't run with no air filter. You'll end up like blowing up your motor and whatever else. But I have a, I have a few ideas. I kind of want to see what happens when I just throw gravel in the intake or a bottle of water <laughs> or maybe some sticks or I don't know, whatever I can find because these things are not going home. They're not going anywhere. They're never going to be salvaged. They're going to be crushed for a couple hundred bucks each. So while nobody's really around, I think we should uh, mess around. Now, I know the turbo works right there. That might, that might be a good one, make everybody cringe. Like, oh my God, that's an SRT4 turbo. That's basically the neon turbo. I don't give a <laughs> Let's see what happens. Look at the intercooler on it. <laughs> Took a took a decent hit, but Gabby was driving it, so I don't I don't know if she really sent it. But let's go around and see which ones will start. This one was mine, kept stalling. It wasn't even responding before, so let's see if I can get it to go. Apparently, um, hey tow truck guys, uh, why is it rolled over now? Ready to fix it up? Sure, sure I will. You all right? Yeah, I'm, I'm all right. Should we go over and talk to him? Let's talk to him yeah. about their disrespect. All right, who's the mother that rolled my PT Cruiser? <laughs> that was a pristine cruiser. Who was it? Was it you? Right there. In the back. Is that what's he doing back there? You think it's funny the to roll of that perfectly PT fine? Would like to talk to You're you. here as a rescue crew to preserve and protect, <laughs> and you got dirt and scratches all on the side of my perfect uh, PT I'll Cruiser. I'll it out later. This guy. We're gonna take you to the body shop, put a little front end work into it, and you'll be ready to go yeah. in an hour. He's new, right? Yeah. Is that why he's in the back seat? Yeah, That's he's right. trouble. <laughs> they don't let me drive much. Uh -uh. You're the booter? <laughs> he is our booter. I told him, I go, what are you doing? I was like, what the f How did it get rolled over? A well, second ago, they were towing it down across the, the track. It the looked good perfect. News is, the good news is your phone mount works great. I know. Let How did you roll it? I didn't even roll it. Yeah. <laughs> You were towing it. Yeah. That's the most dangerous <laughs> time. Oh, you, you did? Yeah, you were driving it. <laughs> hey, we're going to go over here and start them and throw dirt in the intake and blow them up for a little bit. So we'll just be working on them over here. Oh. Trying to get them running. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've never rolled a car being towed. Only a crash recovery crew could do that. At least we know the rollover safe. Look at this. That's hilarious. Nope. This one looks good. Yes. Okay. This looks like it's a little hot. I think that's where the hole is. I think that's where I'm not supposed to do, put anything in there. No, that's where you put stuff in. I know. That's where ever, my dad's like, never touch, don't put anything in there. Yeah! That just lets you know you're alive. <laughs> oh, that'll start. 
it'll start, but we'll have to jump it. Should I keep it running? It's got a good beep. I don't think it's moving. So we got two runners. <laughs> as soon as I let off pressure, it just came right off. I've always wondered what will happen if I put a little dirt in the air intake of my PT Cruiser. Let's try it out. Oh, it did just die. <laughs> Think it'll start? That was quick. I didn't really mean to put that much in. It sucked it in, did you see? Maybe I just stalled it out with the bottle. That might've been it. Let's try to start it again. Come on, come on. Did it start? Did it start? It's going, it's gonna go. <laughs> the clicking sound means it's ready. That was quick, too easy. I told you Cody it would die right away. Car number two, we are definitely, don't ever lose your registration and never put it in your air intake. I know a lot of people probably have done this, but I'm gonna show you why you should never do it. We better get to it. Good, 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 good. There it is. Oh, oh. Go to your home. Oh, never put your finger in there. Don't put your finger there. Can you imagine bringing that to your mechanic? He's like, it looks like part of your registration's in the intake. Yeah, that's what that sound is. Did you put your paper registration in your intake again? Sorry. All right, what else we got? Nothing to see here, just carry on. I have some protected leaves from the uh, California desert. Just don't tell anybody. We don't want to go to prison out here. Go home, dear It's running better. Good. See how hot she is. Oh, we're still running cool. Okay. Is this sage? Oh, yeah. Smells good. You have a commercial grade lawn shredder. This is the way to do it here. Too. You hear that? Nice. You gotta get it really in there. Like... <laughs> She's thirsty. you let's check the let's check the engine oil I'll clear it out Parker Parker taught me this it's a dental move yeah I think you can hear my registration in there and always return your oil stick you don't want to fuck that up there's a clank over here I don't know what it is watch out oh we're good don't need that anymore.
Oh, 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 oh. It idles better than on throttle now. I think she's starved for fuel. I wish I had a fuel source. You ever put gasoline in your oil intake? Mm. She's still idling, she's not hot. Where's the fuel at? Do a, pour a little gas on here, straight to the intake. We have dirt and stuff in there sometimes, it happens. This will get us started. Oh, it wants to eat it. It wants it. No, stop. I don't know how it's starting on fire. <laughs> they have fire extinguishers. If you get a little dirt in your in your oil cap area, all along your the top end of your engine, and it won't it stalls out. Just throw a little gas in a rag. It sucked it all in. <laughs> Did I help it? Go, go, baby, go! Woo! <laughs> Some reason I don't think our temperature gauge is reading properly. It's hot now? It's hot? Now you know. Now you know. And that's your tip of the day. From old Uncle Chet. Dude, it just sucked it in there. <laughs> yeah! I want gasoline! <laughs> it's my fuel! <laughs> I got a, I got a few fans. I gotta go shake some babies and kiss some hands. So, we gotta go back. We'll be back, young lady. Don't go dying on me. <laughs> These nice ladies here, I thought I'd show them a little bit of car maintenance, kind of how engines run. You need air, you need fuel, and you need a spark. So right now we'll go over mainly the air and the air intake. You know, you have to change your air filters. Well, it's usually right here. This is your, this is your air filter. This one's not that bad. If it they're looks great. It's super, it's really done. clean. You should yeah. replace these, what, every, every five, five, six years. years? Yeah, there you go. And when they tell you your oil needs to be changed every like few thousand miles, they're lying. <laughs> so this is the air intake right here. So what it's doing, what it's doing, it's sucking it, it's sucking in air through the intake, and then gas goes in, and then there's a little spark, and it makes an explosion in the in the cylinder. Okay. So a lot of things you don't want in here is water. Don't want water. Yeah. So like if you drive underwater, like if you had a Tesla, you can drive underwater. But if you have <laughs> an air breathing car, you can't drive underwater. Everybody knows this. So just give it a little squirt. Yeah, it likes it. And then here's your engine oil. So when you get your engine oil changed, one thing you don't want on there, where, I need, there's not some dirt. Oh, that's a good sand. Oh, there we go. oh yes. Well, that's really good, see? Yeah. Normally, when you take, you don't need that anymore. Normally what you see here, this is where all the oil goes in, right into the lifters. Yep. And then you add a little water right in there. Good as new. No planking. That's kind of nice. Yeah. Now, if you don't have your air filter on, you can get dirt and grime in your intake. So this is, if you don't have your air filter on. Okay, now it's dead. <laughs> so that's what you should never do to a car. Never put dirt in there, never put dirt in the intake or water. So now you know. What not to do. What not to do. It smells really good. And that's your tip of the day from old Uncle Chet. <laughs> Now it's a diesel. Alright, thanks for the lesson. Thanks for the lesson. You need uh you need to help with the box? You're gonna carry that whole thing? Alright. Yes. Bye Till next time. Hey, you have any race fuel? What do we need race fuel for? To put in the intake, because I oh. put dirt and rocks in there and it's not running right anymore. What'd you do that for? Well I wanted to 
show off to the girls and then I broke the engine. So didn't really work the way I thought. Solid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, oh, this is my baby! This is my baby! <laughs> Let me, I'm gonna move my range over. I feel like we should move the range over. Oh, is that your couch? Nothing can go wrong with this. Woo! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Did I make a little dust? Is that the end of it? You might want to look out. <laughs> and that's a wrap. I always wanted to practice. <laughs> I'm going home. Go. And that is another day chilling oh. with Chad. <laughs> 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 Nothing to see here, man. Just keep driving. <laughs> yeah, we cleaned up. There was a lot of trash. We had to clean it up, so we're good now. I wasn't involved at all. I was just I was just instigating. Obviously know you were. Sorry. <laughs> we're good. Okay. No problem. Hey, she said five more times and then we're done. She said five more times and then you guys are done. <laughs> no. <laughs> I was hoping her window was open. Uh, these fucking hoonigans are out here. Oh, it's not gonna do it. Oh, there it goes. It's gonna take forever. Oh, you don't have to go to the gym. That's true. <laughs> I need to go to the gym. Thanks for reminding me.